Okay, some people have raised a question of how uh, much of the field of view the crosshairs take up in thickness. So first of all, I need to point out that they don't actually... Oh, the wind's blowing me all over. They don't actually obscure the center. Okay, this is very difficult to get lined up. Well, this is gonna work. There, okay, there. You can see they don't actually obscure this very center of the view. You can look right through there. So nothing is actually obscured at the very center. But back to the question of uh, how much field of view do they take up? You can see from here that they take up each about maybe roughly a quarter of a millimeter at 67.7 feet. And that equates to be about roughly two and a half arc seconds. So that's not that bad. Two and a half arc seconds is better than the resolving power of this telescope. And it's better than the, it's smaller than the uh, stated margin of error, the four arc seconds. So the thickness of the crosshairs do not impede the use of this instrument.